Hello everybody, welcome back to Subnautica, where I try to research and scan every single possible thing. Come on, scan, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on! Yes, okay, that's, uh, one added. Alright. Let's continue, shall we? Last time we left off, I asked you guys... What should I call this little sucker? I have not gotten an answer yet, so for now, I am going to call them Hoovy. I already scanned. Yep. Get away! Get away from Hoovy and I will stab you. I will kill you if you. Oxygen. Sorry about the uh, buffer. Anyways, um... Hmm... What next can I skip? Ooh! Giant coral tubes. That I can scan. Uh... Let's see... What else? What else? I think I'm gonna try to go over to the, um... Float form. I'm going to try to go over to that. Um, uh, the, uh, the life pod 3. I'm going to try to go to life pod 3. It says it's in the shallows, which considering how this is probably the only safe part of Subnautica over there, I doubt that it's going to be in shallow water. I highly doubt. Oh no, there's this is a uh, pretty high uh, water actually. It's still mostly just coral and kelp. Oxygen. Oh. Well, I guess good news for me, it's not anywhere close to a reaper or anything. Oh. I am really sorry about the buffering. Yeah, um, anyways. I'm gonna take one breath and I'm gonna go down into it. Dang, battery. Mm, I do not believe I can go into this. Oh, wait, no, there's a hole right over there. Just stop buffering, please. Game. Anyways, uh, let's see what I can abandon PDA. Great. Let's see what else I can scatter. Anything? Anything? Nope. Okay. Well, that's that. Uh, not much else of what I think I can do today. I mean, I guess I could just try to. Beat the game, and well, you know, I don't really have a set plan. Oh, scan this. There we go. This is buffering a whole lot, and it is getting really annoying. I, I'm, I'm sorry if it if this uh, ruins the whole video for you, but I can't really do much about it. Anyways, I uh, saw the last video, and I hope this is um, a good enough audio for you so that you're able to hear me and the game at the same time. Did I scan you? I, yeah, I scanned this guy, right? Okay. Where is the life pod? Where? Hold on. Over there. Oh, I can scan. Ooh. 
if you don't know, I am actually a huge fan of biology and prehistory. So it's pretty cool to have a speculative biome like Subnautica. That's kind of like a survival horror game. This is glitching a whole lot. And I do not know why. I just hope it doesn't stay this way. Um, what did I get? What was it? What was that? Day two. Hmm. Day two download. Survivor. Let's play this. You really think it'll carry two of us? Your regular sea glide pose a mass of 80 kilograms at uh, over 30 kilometers an hour. The power cell rig to this one should double that. You think there's something out there that's faster? Oh, sure. And that's assuming it doesn't overload three meters from the light pod. You're calm about this. I'm seeing the engineering problem. If I stop seeing the maths, I'll be terrified. Okay. That was not important at all. Mm. Uh, indigenous life forms, we got giant coral, uh, table coral, fauna, carnivore, stalker. Alright. I'm going to say this like a old one of those documentary people you'd find on like uh, Netflix or something. Uh, this stalker. No, that's 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 what it is. Uh, the stalker, a streamlined predator, uh, encountered in Kel Force in Wade of Prey, leaving the safety of the shadows to feed. The stalker likely carved out its uh, evolutionary niche at the sweet spot between speed and size millions of years ago. And maybe one of the oldest species on the planet. That's why it looks like prehistoric. Yeah. The stalker appears to be attracted to titanium deposits, which it tends to sharpen and put stress on its teeth. And with many predators, it's possible to temporarily distract hungry stalkers by feeding them. One, teeth. Star Stalker's teeth are unusually hard and fast growing. Its elongated snout is able to deliver a huge biting pressure to large attackers while also being able to reach small herbivores seeking refuge against rocks. Night I actually didn't notice. Night vision, retinal layering on the eyeball suggests adaptation for nighttime hunting. 3. Dorsal ridges. These ridges can be moved independently due to. I am speaking so fast in my mind that my voice can't catch up. These ridges are moved independently to deliver superior maneuverability. So, like, these are like dorsal fins, except on steroids, and the fact that there's so many of them. Alright. Four, pelvic fins. Long, powerful, the Starcraft has evolved to hunt the fastest prey. Oh, so like the little legs back there. But actually, do you think that the stalker evolved on land first? Because I know that in Below Zero, there's like a another speed called the Snow Stalker. That it's like a relative to the stalker, kind of like how hippos and dolphins evolved. Do you think that's what's going on? Because that'd be actually that's actually really cool. Assessment. Uh, stalker teeth may have applications of in the enable glass fabrication. Okay. Uh, anyways. Let's see. Herbivores large. There's one. And then herbivores small. Go bladder fish. I need to scan all the other ones. Let's, uh, read all of these. Uh, guess the quality. Slow-moving life form 
And one of the large, you know, screw this one. I forgot to make a flashlight. Battery and glass. How do I make glass? Quartz. I need a battery and glass. And, and I need some hallucinogenics for the battery. Trying to scan the boom. No, it's good. It's, it's, it's fine. I don't need to scan the damn boomerang fish. I don't know what it is. Let's see. You are a bladder fish. I will eat you later. Oxygen. That is surprisingly close to the uh, surface. So basically what you're saying is that the uh, this spaceship's gonna go bada boom. You could have just said that the Aurora is gonna explode. But Alright Alexa. Fine by me. Anyways, uh let's see. Uh quartz, quartz, not going down there because the deeper I go, the more likely that there's gonna be things to eat me. Uh quartz, quartz, quartz. What the hell is the quartz? Oxygen. Okay. Uh, this is very, very, very difficult to find quartz. I mean, it, in fact, it is surprisingly difficult to find quartz. What are you guys? I'm not gonna pick up those two threads. Got the quartz and go. I don't want those exploding fish exploding on me. Now where is the life pod over there? Okay. How am I doing? Still doing fine, got it. Let's I'm not cooking. I'm not cooking here. Hoovy the Hoover fish. Oh god, that's gonna scrap. That's a good. I need two. I, I need two. You're kidding. Oh, back to the, uh, back to the cave. There's, uh, I need quartz for the light. There's sand down there, right? Why not just melt the... If you can make is stuff as complex as this, you can insert, like, the scanner. You can certainly just melt sand, right? Oxygen. Uh, screw it. My life is not going on. Gotta get it. Quartz. Come on. Don't drown on me. Right, let's go. I'm taking you. I 
I'm going to scan the Gary fish first. Should have called it a snail fish. Now, when it is dark, I uh, just don't know the good thing. Now, when it's dark out, I can do all this crap. Oh, do I already have the standard? Tank. Oh, I have no tank at all. I am also mighty thirsty. Oxygen first. Let's go. Wait, I don't already have water. Yeah, I have water right here. Okay. Vital signs stabilizing. Okay. It's fine. This right. I have no idea how you've gone over here. But I must ask the question. The blood is is yellow as all the others. I'm going to cook you, Gary the fish. I'm going to cook you like how Walter cooks Matt. Alright. Now you, I have no idea where you are, so I'm going to scan a whole fish. It's one of those things, okay. Looks like we just got an e one of those giant circular earrings that make no sense of why you'd wear that. Just get a normal earring. Just please get a normal earring because, like, if you don't want want me to stare at it, don't get it because it is very noticeable. You have a hole in the side of your face. Alright, time to get a bladder fish. Nope, I'm not. I do not need that. I need a bladder fish. Ah, oh, you're trying to eat me. Yeah, think better next time. Lot of fish? No. Where are you? Mesmer. Hello, how are Hello, where are you? Oxygen. Oh my god, it's his brother. It's Hoobie's brother. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kiss you. Did you hear that, Hoobie? You got a brother. Now stay where I can see. No, Hoobie. Hoobie. Where did you go? Hoobie. Hoobie. No! No! Hoovy, where are you? Hoovy. No! Hoovy. Where did you go? Hoovy. Come 
Hi, where are you? It's not safe around here. What is it? No, no. Task it. My game is seriously glitching. Yeah, my controls are delayed right now. <gasps> Hoovy! Hoovy, it's you! It's you, either it's you or your brother. Uh, I do not care right now. Oxygen. I need to grab you, Hoovy. But I'm going to get... Oxygen first. Oh! Hoovy, where are you? Where are you, Hoovy? You're near. You're near. I can smell you. I know you're sent, Hoovy. I know you're here. I just saw a shadow. <gasps> there he is! Hoovy. Alright, now that I've scanned your entire species, you are never leaving my side again. You hear that? And waterfish. Cool. All right. How long have we been recording so far? Oh. A while now. And so so far we have done pretty much nothing except. Flashlight! Alright, now I think what I should do next is get an air bladder. Actually, no, what I should get next is a habitat builder. Because I want to make a little uh, thing for Hoovy. Uh, however, that's gonna t take a while. Um. Get yeah, these are all things that I have. You know, except uh, table coil. Uh, table coil. Actually, no, I'm doing a copper wire right here. I have, uh, I have no table coil, no gold, no copper, no, you know, uh, silver. And I no longer have a battery. Nor do I have acid or copper ore anymore, so, uh, yeah. Wait, so you're telling me that the power cell, which is basically high-capacity mobile power source, is just basically two batteries strapped together with... Let, let's be honest, silicone rubber looks like duct tape. So basically, two batteries stuck with, stuck with uh, duct tape. I, 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 I have no problem with you guys, don't. Oh, what was it? Oh, yeah, I'm getting water. Uh, sweet, sweet. No, I'm not cooking. I'm not cooking a couple of fish. Mmm. Sweet, sweet life juice. I just re realized how weird that sounds. Yeah, it's fine. Anyways, um... I wanted to finish this episode off with a bang, but, uh... I don't really have much to do. I mean, I can check the radio. No, nothing's going on with the radio. What's going on with this? Medi medical kit fiber. Fabricator. Does it just generate medical kits? Yeah, it just generates medi kit, medical kits. Um. Yeah, I guess that's it for today's episode. So, uh, again, everybody, like, subscribe, hit that bell notification because uh, you don't want to upset poor Hoovy. And, um, again, I need an actual name for Hoovy. I will take any uh, recommendations. Uh, heck, if you want to make his uh, name a little pun, I would do that because that would be awesome. Uh, anyways, I will see y'all in the next episode. Goodbye.